the reason why Ebuka songs you know scheduled his own program on the exact date that moses bliss scheduled his own program even though they are both gospel artists and also there are people that are worked together because Ebuka songs actually came out from spotlight nation owned by moses bliss this Ebuka song is somebody that moses bliss have carried like a brother you know like a friend even bought him a car before Ebuka song left now I know that Ebuka songs and Moses Please have been having a little bit of conflict for a while, but none of them have actually come out to you know talk for a while. Now, this show coming up on the 25th of October, Ebuka songs also scheduled his own show on the 25th of October in same Abuja. Now that's where the problem is coming from. If these shows were you know scheduled separately like or maybe same dates but one is in nasarawa one is in abuja or one is in delta state one is in port Harcourt, one is in lagos one is in abuja nobody would have said anything but for the fact that it's in same city and same date now the thing is some people might want to be thinking that what if they are doing this thing for controversy you know controversy sells a lot you guys know this sometimes you see all these celebrities they will just do certain things for people to talk about them when they feel that they are losing you know this slime like that they are losing like relevance in the music industry they can form any story now i know that when it's something like a show you will not say ah but why are they using this something like a show you know coming to sing for god you know to cloud chase my dear anything is even possible but for these two persons since they are not friends i don't think that is even possible now believe me they have actually not come out here to say that they are not friends they have not said it but now what is the truth behind the fact that Ebuka songs will have to post his own show the same time with moses please i know there's another question that we need to answer what if Ebuka songs have actually been advertising that show on that same date and it's moses please that now put his own before after Ebuka song i already put his own and maybe we have seen moses please own because moses please is more popular than Ebuka songs well let me answer that question i have not seen it anywhere on social media that ebuka song was the first person that posted it no i have seen the poster where even the likes of a copy was there and all that but the thing is if you want to ask anybody can decide to put their show anytime and again this thing is something that even you know secular musicians don't do even when they don't care about each other like the likes of davido whiskey they can decide to put a show at the same time they don't care about each other who loves this one most should go to this one show it's not a thing of eh as this one is doing this other person should not do as they will always say the sky is big enough for everybody but in this case these two people were friends you're not going to compare them to the video and whiskey they are not fighting per se as they claim hey because song is one person that has always said that you know people saying he fought with moses please is rumor but the thing is that if you say it's rumor we have never seen you appear on any day uh, moses bliss show or even wishing well on the birthday and all that why we also still remember that before moses bliss wedding ebuka songs and moses bliss was very close to the point that moses bliss bought ebuka songs you know um a car and with other share when those people were arguing him, people even say that ah stop arguing him too much he's about to get married when a lady amongst them was arguing, we said, Don't argue him too much. Somebody said it there. We still remember that that was the period when Moses Bliss was actually preparing for his wedding. It was after the wedding that we now look critically into that video and knew this. So, if these two persons were this close, why would they be putting up a show same time? So, you see, this is a gospel ministry. I don't expect the gospel ministry to be behaving like you know the secular industry where they don't care about each other. I know you might say. The sky is big enough for everyone. Everyone go to the one you care about. But it's not supposed to be. What happens to the body of Christ? What happens to caring about your next door neighbor? What happens to loving your next door neighbor? If they claim that they are not fighting, why should this be done? I know it's in Abuja. It's different churches. It's different. Um, uh, this thing arena is different venue. But man, should it be done same time? Should it be done same time? That's just the problem. But anyway, we don't know. As we said, the sky is big enough for everyone. So everyone can decide to go to the one they feel like. After all, the show is even free. So anybody can decide to go to anyone they feel like. Because the way some people love Moses Bliss is the same way some people love Ibuka songs. And I pray that the both shows, you know, come out and become successful, okay? Because I will not wish the other bad and wish the other well. So both of them are going to be wishing the both of them well. That's all I can say. 
and i pray that there will be no quarrel there will be no fight and there will be no fuse over this bye for now guys